Hi beauties, it's Danny here from Sigma Beauty, Sigma's global makeup artist. We just launched six new quads. They're so cute, they're all dessert themed. Caramel apple, blueberry parfait, bonbon, creme brulee, tiramisu, peach pie. Did a full tutorial start to finish using one of my favorite palettes. If you wanna see how to create this look, then keep on watching. First things first, let's apply a lip mask. Lately, I've been really loving in my brows before I do my base makeup. So I'm gonna do that with my Fill and Blend brow pencil. I wear the shade Light. So there are six new quads that are launching together. I love having the option of a quad because not only are they perfect for travel, they just toss in your bag, but they're really easy to create a full look with the whole palette. All right, now that I have the brows done, I'm gonna go in and apply some foundation. I'm gonna use my 3D HD blender. I know this is a little deeper than my current skin tone. I have self tanner on my chest and my neck, so I'm matching this area. I'm currently not near any water, so I didn't have the chance to dampen my blender, but it still performs so nicely, even when it's dry. With some blenders, I feel like they're just really hard to work with when they're dry. This feel nice and pouncy. You can get nice and close to the brows with the edge of the blender. All right, next we have to get these dark circles. Spectrum Color Corrector. This is the shade light to medium. Look at how flawless. I've been enjoying some cream bronzer lately, and I'm gonna blend this in with the F76 Chiseled Cheek. I love this brush for cream products. And for my eyeshadow palette today, I'm going to be using the Peach Pie Quad. So I wanna keep the cheeks in that peachy theme. So I have my Coral Dawn Cream Blush and I'm gonna apply this with my Kristen Dominique Angled Cheek Brush. So I'm putting down all my cream products first and then I'm gonna go back with any powder products and put those on top. So everything locks into place. With my F40 Angled, I'm gonna add a little bit of powder bronzer. This is the matte bronzer in the shade Light. Works beautifully over that cream bronzer. Blush, I have a Sunset Kiss. And let's apply that with my All Over Face Precision Brush from Kristen Dominique. Really beautiful peachy pink blush. So flattering on everyone. A little bit of highlighter on the cheekbones. This is Twilight, my favorite highlighter. Has a pink undertone, which will be perfect to complement the eye look today. I love how my complexion looks right now, but I want it to last all day. So I'm going to set it with my setting powder. This is a soft focus setting powder. I wear the shade Vanilla Bean. And we're just gonna sweep that all over with the all over powder brush. I kind of leave the cheek area free of any powder because I love how that looks. It's more just like my T-zone and just right under the cheeks here and under my eyes. So once I get to the eyes, I like to take my all-purpose buffer and we're just going to apply a little setting powder right here. And on the nose a little bit. All right, I think the base is complete and let's move on to the eyes. 
I brought you in a little closer to do the eye look. This is the palette I'm gonna use today. This is peach pie. I mean, look how stunning this is. A lot of times I start off the eye look with our Persuade eyeshadow base primer, but I'm gonna use Bubbly today, which is a beautiful like champagne pink shimmery primer. It's gonna look really nice under those peach tones and really make them pop. Just tap it with your finger to blend it out. There are four shades in the quad, which make it really easy to do a complete eye look. So I'm gonna start off with the lightest matte shade, which is Crumble. And that is going into the crease. I'm using the E25. And we're gonna deepen up that outer corner. How that adds just some extra dimension and having that lighter shade will really help ease that transition. I love the E25 because it kind of gives you a head start with your blending. So then once I have that applied, I'm gonna go in with my E38 diffuse crease and just go over those edges. And once I look straight into the mirror, or in this case, in the camera, I can see that I can even bring up that crease shade just a little bit more. Kind of fill in that negative space. Can you see the difference? It's very minimal, but I feel like it makes a difference. All right, then we're gonna go in with the shade Peachy, which is the star of the palette. This is a shimmery peach shade. This is like the prettiest shade I've ever seen. Look at this. So pretty. I'm just gonna apply this with my finger. Concentrating it on the inner portion and the middle portion of the lid and just blending it gently into those matte shades. I'm gonna keep the different textures I have going on with the matte and the shimmer. So just very lightly tapping that in. Stunning. Last but not least, we have the shade Ice Cream, which is the light shimmery shade. This is gonna go on the inner corner. Oof, that packs a punch. Kinda like to just blend it right here. Get that little area. And I'm really tapping off the excess for the brow bone. The deep brown in the palette, I am going to use this as my liner. So I have my E15 flat definer brush, and this is just gonna go right above the upper lash line. And since you have that primer underneath, it's really going to help the shadow stick. This is so soft and beautiful and just a more subtle take on black eyeliner. Gorgeous. Let's wipe off the E15 on my switch because I'm gonna use this brush for the lower lash line. I think I just want peachy on the lower lash line. Just keep it light and shimmery. Curl the lashes. Sinewasi Lash Mascara. For lashes, I wanna keep them light and airy. I'm going to apply the Style Whimsical. All right, I think the eyes are complete. All right, to finish off the look, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of lip gloss have the shade Quarter Rosa here. If 
that is my completed look. Perfectly peachy. Head over to sigmabeauty.com where you can now shop all of our little bite-sized cuties. I'll see you next time. Bye. Good.